It's been a while since I've done a video and I am in my studio downstairs. That was the dog shaking. Uh, I can't edit that part out. <laughs> um, these are paintings that I've moved and I've put into, this is a year round studio that I have, but I do the walls in case people come by and they want to visit. Got to move around here. These are those um, garden pieces I just finished a cow and this one's called the garden party it's been a while since I posted these to Facebook but at least you can get an idea for size that one's 30 by 40 and here's the dog I finished I can't get any further back so sorry about that it's been a while since I've posted any of these pieces so I've kind of got these interspersed. These little sculptures down here are the ones I've had for sale for a couple years. They're by Ernie Jones. He was a local Gloversville artist. This piece, the date on that is 2011. So I'm not going to tell you how old I am, but I've been painting since way before then. This woman, I, I did a while back, but I just put a glass of wine in her hand because she looked like she seriously needed one. Um, this was in, this piece was inspired by Redon. He's a was a French painter, but I love how the flowers just feel like they're moving. And I'm really in my older age. I'm really into this color violet, which you can see, and I love that violet against that bright yellow. These are some little abstracts, and I I framed them all because. I like them. It's just something new for me. I'm so, you know, as an artist, you kind of get into a pattern of what you do. And I kind of want to break out of that just a little bit and make sure that I stay fresh. This is my easel. And those are all my paint sticks. I do a mixture of oil sticks, which those are called RNF pigment sticks, along with oil paint. You can see how neat I am. Not. Um, but I kind of like to mix them together. That's a piece called Her Own Sunset, which was actually a um, sunset of Mayfield Lake. And then I put the figure in there, which I kind of liked. This piece actually converted from a different piece. There, that bottom right corner wasn't working for me. So I redid that flower and made it giant rather than small red flowers. These give you an idea for size. That's 36 by 36. And then this last one, that's 30 by 40. So if you're in Mayfield, come on over.